Um, my name is Alexander Tamalunas, and I'm a resident in training at the Department of Urology at the University Hospital Munich. Um, so recently, the European Association of Urology recommended hexane extracted fruit of Serenoa rapens in their guidelines on the management of uh, non neurogenic male LUTs. So despite previously lacking recommendations for permixone, uh, which is hexane extracted serenol repens, um, and also uh, the most investigated um, hexane extracted serenol uh, repens extract in clinical trials, um, where it also proved effective for male LUTs. So in contrast to uh, these positive findings in clinical trials, the underlying mechanisms were uh, seldom addressed and are only marginally understood. So therefore, we investigated the effects of permixone on human prostate and detrusor smooth muscle contraction and also on uh, growth related functions in prostate stromal cells. And uh, we could show that uh, permixone inhibited alpha-1 adrenergic and also tramoxane induced, so non-adrenergic contractions in prostate tissues and uh, metacholine and tramoxane induced contractions in detrusor tissues. Um, while on the other hand, um, non-adrenergic uh, contractions in both tissues uh, induced by anotoline 1 could not be inhibited. Um, Permixone also uh, inhibited neurogenic contractions uh, in both tissues in a concentration-dependent manner. And uh, furthermore, in uh, WPMY1 cells, which are immortalized uh, human prostate stromal cells, uh, permixone caused uh, concentration-dependent breakdown of the actin polymerization and inhibited colony formation and reduced cell viability and proliferation, however, uh, without showing any cytotoxic or, as previously rumored, uh, pro uh, uh, anti-apoptotic effects, uh, pro-apoptotic effects. So, um, in conclusion, our results show for the first time um, a novel basis uh, that allows to fully explain um, the ubiquitous uh, beneficial effects of uh, hexane extracted serenol rapens in uh, clinical trials. Uh, this is a very good question, and um, there is evidence uh, pointing to the importance of the extraction method, to be honest. So previous studies uh, using different saw palmetto extracts obtained by uh, different extraction techniques and solvents uh, did indeed point to shared effects of the different extracts. Um, for example, non-competitive binding to alpha-1 adrenoceptors. Um, however, the potency and efficacy um, strongly varied between uh, the different uh, the different extracts. So even though um, the binding of, of different uh, saw palmetto extracts to the alpha-1 and receptor uh, previously suggested a class effect, the varying potency may explain um, why there is only evidence for efficacy in vivo from clinical trials for um, hexane extracted uh, serenol rapens extracts, but not for other extraction methods like um, ethanol uh, extracted um, serenol rapens fruit. Um, so th this study I, I, I just commented on, um, the same group um, performed an in vivo study later and um, they could not uh, verify the uh, non-competitive alpha-1 um, antagonism they could previously show in their in vitro uh, experiments. So what we did uh, in our experiments was that we re-extracted permixone um, pills with n-hexane, uh, by which also uh, active compounds may have entered our solution. Um, but still we used uh, the medication that is actively prescribed and not a purified uh, a powder provided by a pharmaceutical company. Um, so the presumed bioactive components of, uh, of saw palmetto extracts uh, include fatty acids and phytosterols, and um, serenol rapens fructose uh, extracts predominantly consist of fatty acids and um, are a rich source of the saturated, uh, for example, medium chain fatty acids like uh, laureate and uh, myristate. So some of these free fatty acids, uh, such as lauric and myristic acid, 
um, may even prevent um, testosterone-induced BPH uh, in rodent models, for example, in rats, or also inhibit phenylephrine, so alpha-1 adrenergic uh, vas deferens uh, contractions, while on the other hand, um, palmitic acid uh, may even inhibit prostate cancer cell proliferation. However, these Free fatty acids, so uh, the presumed bioactive components, are also part of other serenorapins, uh, saw palmetto extracts, for example, um, ethanolic and liposterolic extract of uh, saw palmetto, um, which does not have the positive findings in in vivo trials. And also, in summary, our data are limited to non uh, the data, not our data, but the data are limited to non-human tissues like rodents which may not, again, be extrapolated to uh, humans in vivo. Um, the effects of uh, permexone on smooth muscle contraction are, in fact, similar. Um, we observed at concentrations ranging from around 1.6 to 48 uh, micrograms per milliliter, a significant inhibition of uh, alpha-1 adrenergic prostate smooth muscle contraction um, of around 30 to 60 percent, uh, which increased with amounts of applied permexone extract. So this is comparable to alpha-1 blockers, even like tamsulosine, in an organ bath uh, setting in vitro. Um, and in fact, our findings uh, with the alpha-1 adrenergic agonists where concentration response uh, were not right shifted, but Emax values were obviously decreased. And also with non-adrenergic agonists, uh, where contractions um, with U46619, a tromboxane A2 analog, and metacholine were partly inhibited, are in line with the previously cited studies uh, reporting lacking antagonism uh, by saw palmetto extracts at uh, the alpha-1 adrenergic receptor. So in our current study, uh, we could show that permixone um, hexane extracted uh, saw palmetto inhibited um, various adrenergic, alpha-1 adrenergic contractions up to around 60%, which is well in the range of alpha blockers uh, like even tamsulosine uh, in vitro. However, um, the limited efficacy we observe in vivo um, suggests and has also uh, been shown by our laboratory previously that prostate smooth muscle contraction may be facilitated uh, through so-called non-adrenergic agonists like tromboxane or anatoline. Um, and in this regard, we found that permixone also inhibited um, the non-adrenergic contractions with the tromboxane analog U46619. Um, while tamsulosin uh, indeed has no effect on uh, tromboxane induced uh, or any non adrenergic contraction in human prostate smooth muscle contractions. However, in, um, in vivo trials, uh, permixone is inferior to alpha blockers if you look uh, um, at uh, Qmax and also IPSS improvement. Um, and this essentially shows us uh, the limitations of extrapolating in vivo experimental data to patients in vivo. Um, so we do not know if a combination of uh, the phytotherapeutic um, uh, saw palmetto extract and um, alpha-1 blockers uh, is useful in, clinical, uh, in a clinical setting. So apart from the question of uh, combining alpha-1 blockers like tamsulosine and um, uh, hexane-extracted saw palmetto extracts, um, our data for the first time provide a novel basis uh, that allows to fully explain the ubiquitous uh, beneficial effects of hexane-extracted um, saw palmetto extracts and therefore provides a basis um, for us urologists to um, recommend at least uh, this one uh, phytotherapeutic agents uh, for patients who specifically um, request alternatives to uh, the standard of care medication like alpha-1 blockers.